This shit is about to go dummy hard in this beat. Born! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I'm a prophet. I descended from the heavens to, to preach the good word. I, uh, 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 white people, white people, white people. What did I say? I said that there is a Falcons Easter egg. And I said, I don't make any guarantees, but I'm thinking that's Julio Jones in there. Boom! 98 overall, Julio Jones popped out of that Easter egg. Which means, finally, after so long, my prestige pays off. At the start, the very start of Wheel of Ma, I said I would prestige Julio Jones. And for months, he was useless. But now we have the best wide receiver in the game, and it's not even close. At six foot yes, three, wow. bigger than Des Bryant, he has 99 speed, yes, jump, catching, catching traffic, 98 spectacular catch. Uh, wow. Yeah. He's absolutely maniacal. And so he's a 98 overall with 96 speed, but with the power up and sprinter, it takes him to 99. So finally, Julio is coming back in the lineup to wreak some havoc. Let's see what we can do with him. So I'm just gonna go route technician. He's a route runner, so it's not four AP, it's three. That's awesome. I got double me on him, West Coast. Now right now, super weirdly, Sugar Rush art isn't loading. So I'm not gonna do that. And also I think it's kind of cool to go superstar MVP's art. He's a throwback to his first little prestige upgrade but he's got the gold 99 up there i just think it looks really cool so i'm gonna keep it like that i need to mess around with my ability points here though so i have my edge protectors i still like that we're just gonna take tight end apprentice off of darren waller i feel like all the time i just run streaks with my tight end anyway i'm never making those corner round adjustments we'll take tyreek's ability away and we're gonna give it to julio i think it's more likely that julio is gonna activate double me i want julio to have the ball in his hands as much as humanly possible all that means right now is we have an absolute electric start to this wheel of mine and don't even forget hold up wait a minute i have an ultimate egg i have no idea what is in this ultimate egg but i pulled an ultimate egg at the end of last episode i also have multiple grand eggs small and medium eggs that we earned through the last two episodes of wheel of mine so what we got here is one ultimate egg it was like blue and gold so i almost want to say like it might be like boss legend ultimate legend that would be sick but we'll have to see and then i have two grand eggs a medium egg a small egg and another grand egg so all these go on the team if they help the team we're gonna have a god's squad after this i know that much all right without further ado i guess we'll just start with the best one the ultimate egg is right here let's see what we can get what the fuck is that enemy Whoa! Whoa! at bro a judevian clowny mutt 21 golden ticket G -g 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 golden tickets are not out yet what is this holy shit that egg i got at the end of last episode is a golden ticket clowny 93 holy speed 96 shit. excel 94 streak 95 tackle play rack block shot power moves 65 255 what is this card no seriously what am i looking at holy shit Dude, I literally, like, I have no idea where he's gonna go into my lineup. What if, should I make him my user? Oh, can I put him at a different position? What if my user linebackers were Clowney and Devin White, and then Jamal Adams actually plays safety? I don't even wanna open the other eggs right now. I need to figure out where the hell he's going in my lineup. Dude, that's insane. They really put a golden ticket? See, they do do this. Every once in a while, the devs will just make their own golden ticket, which is, I think is actually really cool. So that's what this is out of nowhere. The Christmas promo was so lackluster. Like, the presents were kinda ass, so I didn't expect much here. I guess I will. Let me open the rest of these eggs and then I'll figure out what we're going to do with Clowny. I don't even remember what my other grand eggs were. One of them is team of the year. I got Patrick Ricard. Wait, do I already have him on this team? I'm trying to remember, bro. So I got Patrick Ricard and Fred Warner. Damn. What is he? What? Uh, Super Bowl players. Okay. So I got Super Bowl. <laughs> Are you shitting me? Did I really just pull? Up, uh, maybe like three episodes too late, bro. Holy shit! I don't think I can use either of them. Well, obviously I can't use Tyreek. Get a medium egg here with Donovan McNabb. That's kind of cool. Obviously won't be going in a lineup, but pretty cool. Next up is a small egg, a little team standout. Jayon Brown. And then I have one grand egg left, dude. They went balls to the wall on the Easter promo. They really went so hard. We're gonna get a playoffs player. 95 Stephen Nelson. That could be really, really good. We're gonna have to check out our lineup and Joe Montana, who probably won't do anything. Why would you say that? 
I think the game is just bugging out. There's probably everyone is online right now just tweaking balls about what is going on. So Keanu Neal comes out. Thank God. So now it's Clowney, Bevin White, and our linebackers. I want Lurker, Deflator. That's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna give him an avalanche. So he's got 95 speed user right here. Now Jamal Adams also has Lurker, Deflator. But Jamal Adams is 4 AP for Lurker. I don't need to use Lurker on him anymore if I'm not gonna be using him. I'm gonna give Jamal Adams a new look. Giving him the team of the week. So Jamal Adams to free safety. Landon Collins to strong safety. Bates is gonna be the backup. So Chase Young comes off one edge. TJ Watt comes off the other. Clowney is the user in the middle. Jamal Adams is up top. My prestiges this year are goaded. Aaron Donald, Julio Jones, TJ Watt, Jamal Adams. Yeah, this team is actually like kind of God squatted already. I can't even fathom what a wheel spin is gonna do for us, especially now with Clowney in there. So we'll just have to see as we play but I won't get ahead of myself. I'm just, I'm really, really excited right now. So all my players are sprinter at plus two speed, acceleration, and jump, and they lose two strength, two agility, two change. I'm gonna spin this wheel, but don't expect much. Debbie, if I'm really reaching for straws, I can still upgrade my offensive line. My backup halfback is actually horrible. It's the Danian Tomlinson. So you know what? Oh, shit! Ah! Well, this is still really good. So I won't get ahead of myself here. Jackpot, but they have to have less than 78 speed. So that's offensive line. It's also defensive line. My defensive line doesn't need any help. I guess I'll get to Castro replaced with like an actual god. And my best play is just to grab a right guard. So there's a Kyle Long and a Jari Evans. 75 speed on Kyle Long. This is actually clutch. That This is like one of the few spins I could have gotten that would be super relevant to what I'm doing right now. Kyle Long with insane stats across the board. Basically an end game right guard. And I don't know if I'm an absolute cornball, maybe I'll prestige it. Although it's unlikely. I got a prestige of the clown once I get this Super Bowl. All right, West Coast now, my boy, and we're good to go. I really cannot believe this Easter promo. It's so un-EA to be that like crazy. Like All those eggs were nuts. Kyle Long, a 99 overall. This is like my dream team. The only part of this team that's not my dream team is Dalvin Cook, and that's a prestige. So maybe my prestiges aren't that genius. All right, now all I really got to do is get a backup for my boy Dalvin or even a new starting halfback, but I highly, highly doubt that. Let's just grab like a 96 and go behind it. Okay, 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 okay. If I play well and actually win when I get a challenge like this, then we totally can. Solid. Okay, this is good. Spin, okay, as we see his top three, he's got Julio, he's got Tyreek. This is gonna be a good one. I got my challenge wheel spinning at the same time too. Literally a brand new top three, bro. A and this challenge. Okay, I had to get exactly 69 rushing yards or exactly 69 passing yards with my halfback. So if I accidentally hit 70 on rushing, I still have the chance to get exactly 69 passing. Or if I go over 69, like I break off an 80 yard run, I can still do it in the passing. So yeah, this is a new one. Lots of new stuff. That top three, bro, Two even two episodes ago, that top three was entirely different. That's why you don't skip episodes of Wheel of Month. Just saying. We're in the home stadium and we are starting with the ball, which I absolutely despise. As you guys should probably know by now, I still think we can make this work. Okay, so there's literally no QB spy. Deshaun has all the time in the world to take off for 12. Woo! All right, he's got Vita Vea in the middle, I think, with inside stuff. So yeah, I don't think I'll have any crazy good luck going up through the middle here. Let's just try some weird stuff, you know? Thank God for all this pocket time. X, secure catch, yes! That's caught it, baby! Let's go! 37 yards. I don't know what his strategy is. 10 and 2 is not working, especially because I now have a godly offensive line. It's just not the move for him right now. Let's just go to Delvin. He does have inside stuff. There's a chance this gets blown up. Ooh! Okay. Sometimes inside stuff works against you. Like, Vita Vea got too deep in there. Balls, bro. It always sucks when you go too deep and then you just can't pull out. Second and four. Julio's on an island. I don't really want to go Bye, for him yet. Have a great Ooh! Day. Dude, holy shit. There was, oh, and a nasty dude. Watch that back, dude. He put a QB spy on me, and the defender who was man covering Julio got stuck on the QB spy. All right, I'm gonna go Dalvin in the middle here. Yup, yup, Dalvin. Okay, okay, okay. Yup, reach for it. Why am I talking shit about Dalvin? Why do I need a halfback? Dalvin plays amazing. As far as Matt Maher is concerned, this is one of my best starting drives. Let's try Darren Waller out route. Third and goal. Did he forget to QB spy? I played that smart. I played that really smart. I will take my three. To be honest with you, I'm always starting drives, throwing interceptions. So it's embarrassing to kick it from the four, but he had me in a box there. All right, first and 10. 
He's got to run up the middle. And now he's there, baby. Second and eight. He's still in it. All right, a right side run. <laughs> all over it. Three yards are going nowhere. Third and 11. All right, definitely a pass. Play action there. Yup. Yup. What is that throw? <laughs> I thought that was an interception. So you can have fourth and 11 from the 19 and a quick punt. This does not strike me as a guy who's faking it. I'll definitely be ready for it. Fight. Ah, okay. <laughs> I'm intrigued. I don't know why you do it, but I'm intrigued. I mean, even if he caught that, what, what's the game plan? I want Dalvin Cook to be able to get some yards here. Clean. Oh, no, I needed to break that tackle. Damn it, dude. His defense is really good, honestly. This man coverage is hurting the hell out of me. I'm gonna look for Julio. Julio! Julio! Let's go! Finally, got in the end zone. Hey, 10. 2-0, and I have to remember Dalvin Cook's rushing or receiving yards. I can't forget. He subs Drew Brees out for Lamar Jackson. Had enough of the man. Oh no. Goes with a read option. Whoa! What was that? Somebody was about to tackle Lamar and just forgot to. Probably not a galaxy brain strategy, boys. I'm not gonna lie. Ooh. <laughs> Thrown into a tight window. That's bold. Second and one, though. Yeah, he's got the edge protectors, so I don't know if I'm gonna be coming through anytime soon. Oh, I lied. I completely fucking lied. DJ Watt just bullied that man. Literally, as I said it, that's creepy. All right, I'm sending everybody. He throws a very interesting route, but I think he caught that. First and 10, is this a run? It's not. I don't know what that is, but it's my ball. That's a boy. Throw that man. Throw that man. Oh, I get a rage, but we might. Let's see how this drive goes. I don't know. Maybe Julio gets open here. Holy shit, you're kidding me. Holy fuck! Ooh. No! He got to me so fast. That's so unlucky. That is so unlucky. Julio toasted him as a touchdown. And he's gonna get a pick six off of that. Congratulations, bro. Congratulations. I will not throw this game, I'll tell you that. This man's gonna get toasted this whole game. Yup. Julio's gonna have a field day. This is gonna be fun. Ooh, but I can't I can't use too much clock here. I have three timeouts. A touchdown before half is all I need. <laughs> he just tried to come off the edge. That was weird. That was 26 seconds for it right there. That's a lot longer than I wanted. Second and inches. We're up to the 45 though. Aaron Waller and then DJX. We just make the read. It's just over and over and over. We just make the read. This should be Dalvin out of bounds. What a play. First and 10. Ooh, I almost. B. No! Oh, no, 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 no. Shit! I'm such a clown. I'm such a clown! Whatever. I'm still winning this game. He's gonna throw right here, and I'm gonna pick it off. Ooh, I need my pick six, bro. That would've been clean. 10 seconds on the clock. I kind of want this ball back. Let's see if this guy will do something stupid enough to throw an interception. No way. But how? Gotcha, bitch. Yes! Yes! I have no idea how we threw that. I'm impressed, honestly. But this game was really gearing up to be 17 to 0, and I threw a wobbly pass that was a pick six. And now it's 10 to 10. Complaining won't change what happened, right? Just gotta keep playing football, baby. It's a run play. Yo. No fucking way! But, like, what are you, what are you running through? You hit, you collided with, oh my God. This is so ridiculous. I'm so over it, bro. Kicks a field goal, that's fine. You gotta go get a touchdown though, I'll tell you that. Definitely gotta convert one of these now. No more rooms for error. Definitely can't fumble the bag now. I'm gonna block Dalvin. Actually, no, doesn't this work? Third and 10. Yup. Oh, weird angle, but I think it's still okay. Fourth and four. Can we do it one more time? This is sketchy. This is real sketchy. Fourth and four. Tariq! This is painful. This is so scary. And I still gotta get those exact yards with Dalvin. I'm gonna try the draw play. Oh my God. Oh, Dalvin! I'm not too close to my challenge still. That's the only thing. Second and one. Let's see how this sets up. Ooh, I like that. Sheesh. Sketchy, sketchy business. No question about it. We have to get in the end zone. No field goals here. Ooh, okay. 
I kind of like that. Blue routes are looking kind of nice right now, no lie. Third and three, I'm going with the counter. I don't know why I see it. I just see it right now. Yup, yup. Let's go! I need to score quickly. I'm not trying to play two clock shenanigans today. I want to score. I don't know where his user is. Dear one. Touchdown! Done! Let's go! Come on! 17-13. Monster drive. I, I really believe his offense is ass. It's so ass. He has a pick six touchdown, two field goals. I think I smell hit stick fumble on this. Ooh, darn it. So I'm gonna float the right side. Could be a run play, but I'm leaving the middle open here. Okay. Okay. Oh. Big, big hit! Give me that shit! Come on! Let's go! Ah! <laughs> he dead stopped Tyreek? Because I don't know why. He lost all his momentum. Now you've got the smallest wide receiver in the game with no momentum getting lit up. Oh my God. That is huge, bro. If you saw the mega sell pack and play banger, you know that I've sold games before. Honestly, probably my worst sell this whole year was that game. So I need to maintain the composure that I've had and close this out for two minutes and 44 seconds. There's a 98 right guard on the line here. He's gonna want something deep because he's frustrated right now. It's exactly what I'm talking about, actually. That was an excellent throw, too. I'm gonna send some heat this time. He's definitely done this before. He wants the touchdown right now. I got the post. Okay, that's actually fine. Takes it to the two minute warning. <sighs> he lasered me with that again. God damn. Ooh, yeah, he's gotta go for it, doesn't he? This could be big right here. Let's see what the boy Clowney has to say about this. Right here. Right here! No fucking way! What? You did- Bro, that was so ass. You just threw right at my dude. As long as he doesn't get the onside, we're clean here. Yup, that's Bryant. Good hands. Damn, you never see Dez have good hands in clutch situations like that. I'm just, you know, I keep making those jokes about Dez. I never watched him play. I never watched any of that happen. I just know that it's a joke. So if any Cowboys fans want to let me know, it'd be cool. It was the halfback counter that secured me that super clutch fourth and three. I think it could secure me a super clutch first down right here too. Let's see how it looks. Excellent setup. His user is there. Huge conversion. I think we're gonna early rifle this to Julio. We gotta see it though. We gotta see it first. Okay. I'm throwing that to Julio. Yes, sir! Yes, sir! 99 Julio, get the fuck out of my game! Rage quick, come on! Yes! Ice and beans! Let's go! Playoff bout, baby! Big time GG's, bro. All right, he responded with a GG. That's mad respect, bro. I'd be so hot. Now, unfortunately, right there after Julio caught that, I was kind of hoping that I could look at Dalvin's stats and then try to finesse it if it was still possible. I don't think there's any chance he landed perfectly at 69, so we didn't win that one. But we do win the Rage Quit Wheel, which we have been getting a lot recently, and I love to see that. I think this is our third straight Rage Quit Wheel, isn't it? Here's our third straight Rage Quit Wheel, and I don't know what that says, but... Series Redux Random Scroll. With my team as good as it is, I don't realistically see anything good happening, but Series Redux, we sort by time remaining, and now we just start scrolling. I can't see. One, two, three, go, 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 and land. Mmm, I already got 96, Mike Evans. Yeah, this is an awesome, awesome spin when my team is reset, but I mean, my team is so good. You know, I'm gonna be honest, Clowney didn't even do anything too crazy. He's almost, I hate to say this, I almost don't like him as a user. Jamal Adams is a nasty user. I needed to give it a few more. He's still really big and he still hits really hard. I'll give it a few more goes here. But what I might end up doing is I might make Clowney my on the field edge rusher instead of TJ Watt, then TJ Watt will come where Clowney is. All right, boys, hell of an episode that Puts me in such a good mood. It really does. Like, sheesh. Hey, I know you've seen this well after Easter, but happy Easter. Uh, I love you guys. You're the best. And I will see you in the next video. Peace out.